hi welcome to Google AdWords uh, tutorial uh, in previous two videos uh, we talk about what is Google AdWords and uh, how Google AdWords works and I gave you introduction about uh, AdWords account structure now I'm going to explain you more about AdWords account structure if you want to place ads on Google with the help of Google AdWords this is the main important Google AdWords account structure so you have a client he came to you and said that he want his ads to be appear on Google and he needed traffic and conversion the success will be depend on how well you structure the AdWords account okay so as I show you in a previous video, uh, video there is an AdWords account structure so like uh, you'll be having an account and uh, means next here you'll be having campaigns all campaigns here Second. next is uh, ad groups and uh, keywords and ads and ads it's so account means you have to log in with your gmail account and uh, these are the campaigns ad groups keywords and ads i should not one digital marketing institute came to you and uh, they want to place ads on google now what elements you will take as a campaigns what as ad groups and what are the keywords and ads okay uh, i'll explain these so many students uh, for this question they'll write uh, like this this is assume that this is the account uh, let's call this as dme then as this is a digital marketing in the campaign section they will directly take what a digital marketing institute will be training so obviously uh, they'll be training uh, like uh, SEO SEM SMO and uh, Google Analytics okay so let me write the same thing SEO SEM SMO and Google Analytics so as I said after the account we'll be having a campaign so this student have to uh, this code segments as a campaigns next ad groups so when it comes to SEO there is no separate again segment so they'll take a single uh, ad group so single ad group and after that they'll name anything like uh, again a, a SEO or something some people use on page and off page uh, but it's not correct then they'll go for keywords they'll go for keywords like a uh, uh, SEO training SEO training uh, best SEO training best SEO training uh, SEO coaching or uh, these kind of keywords yes this is not wrong but I'll tell you and uh, we have created some ad also everything right we put a budget and we applied now for all these keywords assume that we gave around 30 to 40 keywords like this SEO training best SEO training SEO coaching SEO training so uh, for these keywords our ad is appearing now a customer from Hyderabad searching that SEO training in Hyderabad okay so in order to attract this guy what you will do is you will create a ad like so this is the ad structure I'm giving SEO training in Hyderabad then here URL then here some text so if a person from Hyderabad searching that uh, SEO training in Hyderabad 
then your ad appeared like this because there is Hyderabad keyword he thinks that yeah local institute he'll click and there is a possibility that there might be a conversion but what is a customer type SEO training in Bangalore then again the same ad will appear SEO training in Hyderabad obviously Bangalore person will not show interest in joining in Hyderabad Institute some people might be click but they don't uh, uh, join in your course so unnecessarily you're wasting your money so then what do you do at a time only one ad will appear even though you have a chance of creating multiple ads at a time only one ad will appear so why this problem has occurred because before you creating adverts account structure you have to think for this campaign means for this client whether we require geographical targeting or not so if this is an institute definitely people search based on the place SEO training in Hyderabad, SEO training in Bangalore, SEO training in Delhi. So this is not a perfect structure. So in a campaign level, I took SEO, SEO, this is wrong. But what I what I say is simply you do one thing, move this to down. Then here you create one more in a campaign take places like Hyderabad, Bangalore, Chennai means wherever your institute is located and wherever you want to target so geographical we have to mention here so for this digital marketing the perfect adverts account structure will be like this so this one so here is your account because this is institute people uh, search based on the place so I took place and after that each place I'm training SEO, SEM, SMO and uh, Google Analytics now we can see this uh, this is uh, account, campaigns, ad groups and keywords under SEO these are the keywords you can even on SEM also you can create some keywords but here in all these things I'm targeting Hyderabad location so I'll be creating a ad with Hyderabad keyword in the ad so that Hyderabad people will be clicking and necessary people will not click on that and my ad is reaching the correct people so what I'm trying to explain is the success will depend on how deeply we are creating the ad groups the more ad groups it's good your ad will be reaching to the right people and think about what elements I have to use in a campaign simple I'll tell you for institutes for schools for colleges for hospitals you have to go for geographical assume that hospital people searched like a best cardiologist in Hyderabad in such a way colleges also they'll search schools also they'll search but think about a product like uh, Samsung Samsung is a client and he came to you uh, for adverts and construction you, you, you thought that uh, for Samsung again I need throughout India like Punjab, Hyderabad, Bangalore you made uh, campaigns like this but do you think customer search like best Samsung phone in Hyderabad best Samsung phone in Delhi they don't search based on the place they simply mention the brand name Samsung some model number that's it so for both kind of products we don't require uh, geographical location okay so before you writing adverts account structure think whether it is suitable or not simple fund is schools colleges hospital and institutes yes geographical location is required so adverts account structure here is a campaign uh, these are the campaigns and each campaign will have a uh, multiple ad groups and each ad groups will have a keywords and then there will be ad and how many keywords I can use how many ads I can use what I'm saying is try to create uh, some good number of ad groups and in each ad group uh, maximum use 30 keywords that will work better and uh, try to take two ads for each ad group 
uh, at a time only one ad will display but uh, Google AdWords will decide which ad is working better so it will do a by b testing based on that uh, it will decide uh, which one is working from which ad uh, click through rate is good conversions are happening so automatically it will make that ad okay so try to take more ad groups and in ad in each ad group try to take maximum of 30 keywords and two ads for each ad group that's it so this is what uh, adwords account structure so previously we learned about what is adwords and how google adwords works what is bidding what is cpc now we learned uh, google adwords account structure and uh, here the important thing is these keywords so i'm mentioning seo training in hyderabad what kind of keyword is this so so the next video you'll be learning what are these keyword if i mention this keyword for which keywords my ad will appear so that video you're going to learn okay thank you very much